So what is going on my fellow collectors? How is everybody doing today? Daredo19 here and today we're going to be doing a quick how-to video on how to set up some LED strip lights on your D-top shelves for your display or your display case or whatever you use to display your figures or collectibles. And let me just tell you, this is probably the simplest thing you can do. I know like you see people's set up with all their lights and it looks like it looks extremely difficult with all the wires and everything. There's really not too many wires to it, just one. Technically, if you just use one LED strip light. On this one, I have two set up and then this one, I have one set up. But I'm telling you, it's so easy to set up and it just makes your display look beautiful just having those lights just running all up and down throughout your detox shelf there or display case whatever you're going to be using bookshelf whatever uh, the the LED strip lights I did get from Amazon uh, you can either get the one that comes with the power adapter which I recommend getting that one first so you can actually actually set up the lights and plug them in once you get one uh, you can get the ones that just include the LED strip lights with the remote without the power adapter, but then you do have to get this this plug right here that is one then turns into two. Then you could set up two LED strip lights on the one of them. And this, I think, cost me like seven, eight bucks on Amazon. I forgot what it's called, but uh, I'll show you pictures. Everything, I'll show you pictures popping up on uh, the LED strip lights and that, that uh, this cord right here that is one that turns into two. I forgot what that's called. Uh, that really doesn't cost a lot so when you do buy it on Amazon it costs uh, like 14 to 15 bucks then plus shipping it'll be around like 20 or 22 bucks. Uh, you do get the power adapter, uh, one roll of LED strip lights. I forgot I think it's like 16 feet or something like that and uh, I still had a lot left over after I put the uh, the the one row in the back and then the one row in the front. This is two separate ones. That's one separate roll in the back and that's a separate roll in the front and then that one is a separate roll as well. Once you use whatever you use, you just cut off what you're done using. Uh, but it, it really doesn't cost that much. The one you need to buy, like I said, is the one with the power adapter. You get the uh, roll of LED strip lights. Uh, then you do get a couple of these. I forgot what these are called. And you don't need to use these to tell you the truth. I, I used to take apart my detox shelves so I thought I needed to put these on here like every time I would move I would take apart my detox shelves but then last time I moved I realized I don't have to take them apart so you don't really need to do that but they include I think three or two of these with uh, the LED strip light set as well and then you do get a remote you could have them blink some of them change color it depends which one you buy I just got the basic one uh, that I don't think mine changes colors but you can make it brighter you can make them blink you can just have them on regularly like that uh, you can have them blink they'll either blink faster or slower but I don't want to come into like a techno room you know what I'm saying but uh, <laughs> it, it's cool the the features that are on the remote so um, the way you set it up is really easy as you can see on the bottom here this is where I started on the right side on the bottom and all I have is one 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 wire running through my detox shelf well one here and then one right here and then everything really comes out to uh, this right here but what I did was take some electric tape and I taped it up to the corner so it's not in the way where I display my figures and then all I did all you do is stick it on so you just gotta peel off the paper on the back to get the sticky part on and then just keep peeling as you're sticking along and try to put it on as even as you can mine isn't perfectly even but it's good enough and I just kept doing it all the way up to the top and then down the other side and then down on the bottom right there and then I cut where I didn't need to use it anymore and then that was it I threw away the rest of the uh, the whatever was left in the roll of the LED strip lights and that's how simple it is. It's so simple to do it. You don't need to do anything else but stick the LED lights on and then just plug them in and then that's it. That's how simple it is to do that. I remember before I did this I always saw people's uh, display shelves and I'm like geez look at all those wires. That must be so difficult to do that but I want to do it so badly. It's so simple to do it. Anybody could pretty much do it. If you're still like younger ask your parents to help you to do it. It, it your dad or mom should really have no problem helping you do it as well but like I said it really does not cost that much money to get this if you want to get the whole set with the power adapter 
the roll of LED strip lights, the remote, and everything else. Uh, it'll cost you total with shipping like around like 20 bucks on Amazon, and and uh, and all you do is set it up, and there you go. You just make your display shelves look so much better. So I just wanted to make this video quickly for those of you who want to set up some LED strip lights on their own display shelves. And you could hook it up on, on a bookshelf if you wanted. I used to have other lights on here as well, but it was I bought like really crappy uh, battery powered ones and they just sucked so bad. So I would just recommend getting these ones on Amazon. It's really simple to do it, but anyway, I, anyway guys and gals, that is my how to set up some LED strip lights on your D-top shelf. Hope you enjoyed my video. If you would like to support the channel, don't forget to subscribe and click on that notification bell. And if you liked it, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't like it, just give it a thumbs up anyway because action figures are awesome. But thanks for watching. I will see you later.